from Ape Ernest as well, we can get as near as possible to a promise of some, because this band here, well, these three bands are all marching eastwards, and they're going to grind to a halt somewhere over London, and then move on slowly again tomorrow, which gives plenty of potential for rain, particularly tonight. At the moment, summer is still ahead of it, the late summer, temperatures approaching the low 20s. Behind this main band, which is a cold front, well, that's where things are also generally fine, they're not quite as warm, so that's the lunchtime forecast where it's an actuality now and this is actually a fairly windy band of rain scattered outbreaks some of which will be heavy and there's still a possibility of, of thunder but as i say the front is moving slowly such that by this time tomorrow it only just gone through london and the ice rather tighter so the winds are on the way up as well the afternoon we'll probably see most of the rain go away from scotland by the end of the day and fine weather for most of the northwest of england and wales showers developing then London area and the southeast by the end of the night, but until that time it's going to be quite warm. A shock to Aberdeen, 16 degrees compared with yesterday's 23. The winds are dying down as the rain edges eastwards, the winds are dying down behind. Tonight then, as the rain sits in the southeast corner, it could spread back along the channel coast as well, and the winds will start to pick up through the channel. It'll keep temperatures up, admittedly. Further north, generally fine, but showers are going to gather and go into western Scotland as well, clear in between. The morning should see that rain roll slowly up through Norfolk, Lincolnshire up the northeast of England, and then probably out into the North Sea, with the winds picking up from the southwest behind it and quite a barrage of showers. It leaves generally fine weather for Northern Ireland and Scotland, but I think with an increase in showers as the day goes on, some of which again could be fairly heavy. Brighter weather to end the day, we hope, in the far east of England, but there'll be some showers getting through there as well. But look at the temperatures down on today, down to about 18 or 19 degrees. Wednesday still fairly windy with rain passing through followed by showers.